to minimize any app, for example, the messages that we have here open, all we have to do is swipe up and just swipe all the way up and it's gonna minimize. And yes, I said minimize because you didn't fully close it. To fully close an app, let me just open up another one. So just clock, I'm gonna minimize this one. I'm gonna open up mail, I'm gonna minimize this one. Okay, so in order to close these apps, we're gonna have to swipe up until around here and we're gonna see our apps popping up and we can scroll through and select any app that we want to open. However, this time we want to close them. So all we have to do is swipe up, swipe up, swipe up, swipe up, and I'm closing every single one of them. So that's how you actually close an app and not minimize it. Again, this goes with any iPhone. So these are the bare basics. If you guys would like to delete any apps from here, anywhere really, all we have to do is hold our finger on top you guys can hold it in for a long time until they start shaking. That's one way. Let me just swipe up on this to get out of this mode. And you guys can also, instead of doing that, holding for a long time, if you're having problems with that for some reason, you guys can always hold on top. You guys will get these selections. Select rearrange apps. Once we select rearrange apps, we're gonna see that on the top, they start wiggling, and on the top, you will see that X. So to get rid of any apps, uninstall them or delete them, same thing with Apple. We're just gonna tap on that X and delete it. So I'm not gonna delete that one because I want to show you guys what that is, but I'm gonna delete the watch one for now. So if you don't need it, you can just delete it. Same thing goes with tips. Although for you guys, I would suggest keeping that <laughs> for now. We're just gonna select right now, delete. To get out of this mode, once we're done, just swipe up and you're done. So swiping up is kind of the same thing as a home button right now. So if you guys are watching any other videos, which I have other ones on the iPhone 6S and so on, then they have a home button. And every time you guys want to get out of stuff or see all your apps, it's using the home button. In this case, we're just swiping up. That's the difference with these newer iPhones.